Well hi folks, I'm walking up to my polytunnel tonight with a bit of trepidation. You can see I've put some little carrier bags on the top, which look a bit strange. The reason is, I got up last night and the birds have been sat on the top of my polytunnel pecking giant holes all the way through the plastic trying to get at the bugs that have been flying around inside my polytunnel, which is nice. And when I say hundreds of holes, I literally mean hundreds and some in like big long strips so I could put my, my hand through from the inside so that was just a quick rudimentary solution to it but tonight I'm going to fix a proper bird scare up because if it happens again this, my polytunnel is just going to blow away so I'll just give you a quick look at the damage they did alright well, folks as you can see up there footprints, webbed footprints so I'm assuming it's oyster catchers and I don't know whether you can see it but I've, I've fixed it with some of this adhesive polytunnel repair tape but they just pecked right along the ridge try and get in close up hole after hole all the way along right round the edges all the way down not just a little isolated one right down the ridge the worst bit was up here where I could stick my hand through you can see absolutely annihilated it pecked great big holes everywhere another one up there just everywhere so needs must I'm gonna fix myself a bird scaring device up and I'll get on and do that and hope it works so with some rigorous calculations and a couple of nails and some wood and a bit of other stuff I'm gonna sort it out On it, I'll get the end of me, me bird scaring device. Tie it on. Health and safety tie. the other end of the bird scaring thing without falling off breaking my legs my neck finished article there we go I don't think there's anything going to be landing on there unless they're proper tough or stupid 
so I think that'll work well I hope it works anyway so hopefully no more big pecky holes in the polytunnel there you go just another lovely task to do to keep the wonderful wildlife off your plot see you later